a local landmark of toys, trinkets, and treasures, will live on to tally up more tchotchkes. Which one's your favorite? Oh, the spider. The spider. Naperville's Magic Rock has been saved thanks to neighbor Kathy Martin. The Magic Rock can now be found at the corner of North Brainerd Street and 7th Avenue, two houses down from its original location. It was a whirlwind for sure. <laughs> Went from uh, having, you know, no plans of having this in our yard to a week later, now it's here. The Magic Rock was started around 15 years ago by Keith Richardson at his home at 711 North Brainerd Street. Kids would bring him toys and knickknacks that he would glue onto a rock, creating the community art piece. Though Martin has only been in the neighborhood for two years, the rock has become a magical family tradition for her. Coming home from work or school, uh, the kids and I would walk over and go play I Spy and just get out of the house, get some fresh air, go see the magic rock, play some games. It's really nice to have something to do so close to home. <laughs> Last August, Richardson sold his home to a new developer who plans to demolish the property. After hearing the news, many in the community were concerned for the fate of the rock and spoke up in support of saving it. In an interview with the Chicago Tribune, Martin said she would consider creating a new magic rock in her yard. This caught the attention of the realtor for the new owner, who asked Martin if she'd like to make the original rock her own. On Tuesday morning, the new developer had the magic rock transferred to Martin's home. So right now it's in a, a little bit of shambles from the move, uh, but we're going to reorganize the rocks and I'm hoping to plant some uh, native wildlife and native uh, flowers and things, perhaps things to help pollinators to pretty it up and get a new sign put up so that community members can know they can start leaving offerings for the magic rock again and we'll continue to put new additions on it. Thanks to Martin and the local response, the legacy of the 15-year-old destination will continue on. We moved here specifically for the community because the neighborhood was so welcoming and really everybody knew each other and I wanted to, you know, be neighborly and help keep that spirit alive. For Naperville News 17, I'm Jesus Cortez.